your daily 180, 180 seconds of pure Bible study. How does God open the hearts of men and women and boys and girls? Welcome to this, your daily 180 Bible study. Thank you for your participation in this study. We're greatly encouraged by that. Well, as we look this week at lessons from the conversion of Lydia in Acts chapter 16, this is one of the great lessons that we come across. Her heart was open, but how was her heart open? If you'll look very closely at the text, it's not difficult to, to see this. I want you to look with me at Acts chapter 16. Begin with me at verse number 14. And you might want to have a little pencil to underline certain phrases. Look at verse number 14. Now a certain woman named Lydia heard us. Why don't you circle that little phrase, heard us. What's Paul doing? Oh, he's preaching. And, and to be sure, he is talking about Jesus the Christ. Okay, so she heard them. She was a seller of purple from the city of Thyatira who worshiped God. The Lord opened her heart to heed the things spoken by Paul. So circle that word spoken by Paul. She heard, and furthermore, it says her heart was open to hear the things of Paul. Verse number 15, and when she and her household were baptized, uh, she begged us, saying, If you have judged me to be faithful to the Lord, come to my house and stay. And she persuaded us. Now, I want you to get this. The opening of the heart required, number one, that she hear, and it required the preaching of the message by Paul. Well, how do you know that, Bill? You never look at a passage in isolation. You look at it in the greater context of the book and in the greater context of the Bible. One of the things that we know as we look at the greater context of the Bible is that Romans chapter 10, verse number 17 says, Faith comes by hearing and hearing by the Word of God. Faith is not just produced miraculously. Faith is the process of an open mind being in an open heart and an individual studying the Word of God. Now, I want you to notice the importance of this. Back in Acts chapter 2 on the first Pentecost following the resurrection of Jesus, Peter is preaching. And he's talking about the fact that this Jesus is the Christ. And he says in verse 36, Therefore let all the house of Israel know assuredly that God has made this Jesus, whom you crucified, both Lord and Christ. Now get verse 37. Now when they heard this, they were cut to the heart. That's what happens when honest people listen to the Word of God. Lydia's heart was open by God's Word preached by the Apostle Paul. Join us again tomorrow.